MassDriver is a single pane of glass for managing cloud operations. Built on open source tools like Terraform and Helm, it helps platform and DevOps teams enable developer self-service while maintaining control of your cloud accounts. On my canvas are a VPC and a Kubernetes cluster managed by the MassDriver platform. On the left panel is a list of cloud services and applications supported by my organization. These are built using IAC tools like Terraform, Helm, and OpenTofu, and they can include your organization's security and guardrails. I'm going to go ahead and add a component called UI, which is my chat application. And what you can see was infrastructure was automatically generated and connected to my application. This allows developers to think about the services that they need and automatically have those dependencies resolved from pre-approved infrastructure components built by your team. Let's configure this Postgres database. One of the first things you'll see on the sidebar is configuration presets. These are presets that your operations team can publish along with your modules, suggesting how to run and scale these services. This allows developers that may not be as familiar with the service to get really good configurations as a baseline. And you can see that there's a number of fields here, all customizable by your operations team that lets you expose additional configuration parameters for your developers. Hit deploy and MassDriver will take care of provisioning and all the state storage of your infrastructure. The MassDriver team considers themselves frugal architects. We think that cost shouldn't be an afterthought. That's why the platform includes costs for all of your resources from within the same platform you use to manage them. Let's go ahead and click on this Kubernetes cluster. On the right side, you'll see a number of tabs, one of which is labeled Monitor. This is all of the metrics available from this set of cloud resources that are immediately ingestible in the MassDriver platform. I'll go ahead and add a couple of CPU metrics really quick. And what this will do is it'll make MassDriver not only the way that I can manage my infrastructure, but the way that my engineers can get insights from their infrastructure as well. MassDriver becomes a source of truth for what you have deployed in the cloud, and the source of truth for your cost and health of your cloud resources. Lowering mean time to resolution isn't just about understanding the health of your applications and cloud services. It's about understanding the changes that affect them. I'm gonna go ahead and click on the configuration panel here and I'm gonna change the configuration of this Kubernetes cluster. Here I've enabled Fargate on this cluster. I'll go ahead and click deploy. And when I click on the History tab, you'll see that each of my deployments has been captured by the platform. And I can do this rich diff. I can take deployments from any point in time and quickly compare them to see what's changed about my environment. This is great for auditing purposes, but also at 2 a.m. when something's gone down and you've received an alarm, when you quickly need to be able to figure out what's changed about your environment. Also, MassDriver has an infrastructure bill of materials. This allows you to see all of the cloud resources that bubble up to a specific IAC module like Terraform, OpenTofu, or Helm. And of course, operations always wants to know what's going on in our accounts. There's an audit log that's maintained by the platform that tracks every change to your cloud infrastructure, new environments, new projects, teardowns, and deployments. Schedule a demo now to accelerate your platform engineering journey.